A tree of Kenyan entrepreneurs is transforming the lives of artisans by creating an online marketplace for their crafts. Built as a one-stop shop for African handicrafts, the digital platform is seeking to reach a global market. CGTN's Wokis Tenyabwa has this story. Bid by painstaking bid, Kimani Nderitu is creating an elaborate work of art. These are skills he has honed over years of practice as an artist. He paints and carves and molds and sculpts. Nothing involving art is too difficult for him to learn. And this year he has acquired even more skills as he ventured into the world of online sales. The Culture Hub by Muthoni Unchained is an online marketplace started by three Kenyan friends with a love of authentic African pieces. They often went hunting for them in street markets. It got to a point where you buy these items and sell them to your colleagues. So we saw an opportunity and a hunger for these items, but people can't easily access them. Some of the vendors whose work they loved lived in far-flung places, and when COVID-19 struck, disrupting the local markets, the need for an online marketplace to connect artists, vendors and buyers became even more urgent. Uh, before Corona, the market was good. All you need to do is to come with new art, uh, very creative and very unique, and people, people are there to achieve it and to accept it. So after Corona, and then everything stopped. Where there are so many artisans or so many vendors dealing in fashion, art items in Africa, but they didn't have a platform where they could access a lot of consumers. The online crafts marketplace brings together artisans as well as raw material providers, enabling the group to negotiate fair prices for raw materials as well as loan services. Artists create accounts, upload pieces, and watch them sell. Over 100 vendors and artisans have signed up. Me all, all, what I normally receive is that, oh, Kimani, bring a certain picture, somebody wants it, I deliver, it goes. Uh, so this is uh, one of the, you know, the market that I would love myself very much. It means sellers can now access markets beyond the country's borders. Our biggest customers have been in Denmark and Germany, where we sell to boutiques there who resell African items. We sell to them in wholesale. Artists continue to long for the day when the pandemic will end and they will be able to go back to the markets that they are accustomed to. But even after they return, online platforms will continue to play an important role, taking their artworks to the world. Wilkes Anyabwa in Nairobi, Kenya.